Sana being the e-commerce solution integrated with the SAP system uses the catalog and all its data directly from SAP. There are user tables in the Sana add-on which are used for catalog management. It is possible that a company stores thousands or even tens of thousands of materials in the SAP system and there is a big chance that you do not want to show all of them in your web store. The tables Visible Product Groups and Visible Products are used to define which materials from your SAP system should be shown in the SANA web store, and the Customer Assortment table is used to set up customer-specific assortment. Of course, it's not handy to fill in these tables with data manually, especially when you have a lot of materials in your catalog. Thus, to make data management easier for these tables, we implemented Data Upload, which allows to export and import data using a CSV file. You can open the SANA Data Upload window either from the SANA Initial screen or by calling the transaction SANA Ecom Data Upload. Using the SANA Data Upload window, you can easily export data from and import to the SANA tables. As I have already mentioned, the data can be exported and imported using the CSV file. So here you can select whether you want to upload data to the table or download data from the table. Using the download option, you can also download the CSV template for a certain table. Here you need to select the SANA table where data should be imported or exported from. And here you need to enter the path to the CSV file with data which should be imported to the table or path to the folder where the CSV template or file with real data should be saved. About this test run option, I will tell you a bit later. This option is applicable only for data uploading. Well, at first let's see how downloading works. Let's select the download option. The SANA user table, for example, visible product groups. And enter the path to the folder where I want to save the CSV file. Then you need to click Execute. If you download data, you will be asked whether you want to download sample data or actual data. If you click Sample Data, it will download the CSV template for the selected table with a few demo records. You can fill in this file with real data to import it to the selected table. If you click Actual Data, it will export all data from the selected table to the CSV file. For example, you can use it to back up data from the table or to export and import data to another environment. If you want to import data to the table, you need to select Upload. The table where you want data to be imported and select the CSV file with data for the corresponding table. Before importing data to the table, you can perform a dry run to check whether the data in the CSV file is valid. To do this, you need to select the option Test Run. If this option is selected, the data will not be imported from the CSV file to the table, but it will be checked to make sure that all records in the file are valid before importing. To show you how it works, I will corrupt some records in the CSV file. And now I will click Execute. So, when the Test Run option is enabled, instead of importing data to the table, the system shows all valid and invalid records in the CSV file. If there are some invalid records, you can open the file and fix it. When all data in the file is valid, you can import it to the table. To import data to the table, the Test Run option should be disabled. 
If you import data to the table from the CSV file without validating it beforehand and there are invalid records, they will be skipped and will not be imported to the table. Well, this is how you can export data from and import to the SANA tables using the SANA data upload window in SAP.